Good evening and welcome to the Hopkins fifth grade concert. Uh, for many of the students here, this is their first big live performance. So we ask that as parents, we do want you to take pictures, but I do want to let you know that HCAM is recording this uh, concert tonight. So we urge you to watch the program live and not through a screen. Kids notice it, we hear about it from our students all the time. We'd really appreciate it. Just put the phone down, have a picture or two, let HCAM do the recording, and when you go home tonight, you'll be able to watch it again on YouTube. <laughs> thank you. Um, also, before we get started tonight, I want to thank the Hopkinton Music Association for all their help and support with uh, everything that we do here. As you came in, we had students and the music association with the programs and the raffle baskets. All of that money goes directly into our programs to help continue to support them. So if you are interested in becoming a member of the HMA, please see uh, our parents out there. Uh, let's get this concert started. First up is Ms. Jessica Barkin and the fifth grade Hopkins Chorus. I'm really proud of the way they just watched me during that sound check, so I'm like super excited for our performance. I'm actually just going to hand it over to Kaisha. There's a couple of program notes that the students um, wrote about the songs and things that they want you to know about things that we've been working on, um, different musical concepts. So I will turn it over to Kaisha. Welcome to the fifth grade winter concert. Our first chorus song is called Shout. The hand motions make the performance very lively, and I can feel the spirit of winter and music when singing this song. We have worked on diction, which means speaking our words clearly. Listen for a clean T sound on the word shout. This song makes me want to join my hands together and raise my heart and voice.
make sure we do our job of making both parts balance.
So I'm going to invite my Jingle Bells people to go back to the stand over there. I'm sure, bring your music with you. And while they're getting set up, I'll talk with you a little bit. My name is Kayla McDonald. I'm the director of the orchestra and the band at the Hopkins School. Thank you so much for coming. The students are really excited to perform for you this evening and to show you some incredibly remarkable progress. Many of them have never touched their instrument. Raise your hand if you've never touched your instrument, band, and orchestra. This was your first year playing. They've never touched them. You're, we're going from that to playing all kinds of different songs and even reading music. I want to thank a few people. Uh, I want to thank Mr. Hay for taking time to assist with our rehearsals, taking extra time to assist with our rehearsals, and also for advocating for our music program. I want to thank my colleagues, especially uh, Chris Sweeney is playing guitar with the orchestra today. I want to thank uh, Catherine O'Toole, who's out here helping out, giving up extra time, and also uh, Dave Purdy, wherever he may be, over there, also giving an extra evening to us. I think Kathy Cameron is also here somewhere, maybe. Well, she's been helping out with the orchestra. And I want to thank uh, Vanessa Bolello and Julie Babson for being here tonight. Thank you. Uh, there are also some high school students I need to recognize who's, who have also given up their extra time. I want to thank Carly Osman and Anwen Quang, uh, Adrina Arcarian, and Sreya Ravi, and Christina Gomez. So thanks very much for being here. Also, I want to thank you for supporting your children in this noisy and expensive endeavor. And instrumental music gives your child a really unique experience and it involves every aspect of their cognitive development. It includes fine motor skills, gross motor skills, reading, and there's even math when we're learning to play an instrument. It teaches discipline and responsibility and it also provides some practice with mental focus. We even do deep breathing here. Please take this time to appreciate what incredible energy they've put into this performance by being an engaged audience. And now for some jingle bells.
everybody. I'm Vanessa Bellello. I'm the principal of the Hopkins School. And I want to thank you all for coming out tonight and supporting our young musicians. Hopkinton is incredibly lucky to have instrumental music in the elementary schools. It's very unusual, and our, our students are super lucky to have that opportunity in addition to general music every week at fifth grade. And as you can tell, it is quite a popular program. We have well more than two-thirds of our fifth graders represented here tonight, and many of them, as you saw, in multiple ensembles, which is a really special thing for us to get to enjoy. I had the um, distinct pleasure to get to sub for Mrs. McDonald about two weeks ago while she was sick, and by midday, I was almost passing out from lack of oxygen. And I, I think as a general educator or a special educator, we look at the music teachers in awe because as you can see, the size of these groups, when you think about what they do, most classroom teachers would freak out if we told them they were gonna have 25 students. So to have 25 percussionists is pretty impressive, or 25 saxophones. So what they do on a regular basis, and then they're making music. It's really a special thing that we have, so thank you for all of your support for the music program and for our young um, students here today. The progression that they make is amazing. If you have an opportunity to see the high school ensembles, the way that they progress through the years is really amazing. And um, to Miss Barkin and Mrs. McDonald, thank you so much, Mr. Hay. The music program in Hopkinton is very special. Please continue to support it. It's a, it's a special thing here. So thank you very much, and enjoy the band.
this will be short, I promise. So our Grail Ensemble is getting ready right now. So this is another featured ensemble. You notice for the orchestra Jingle Bells, we have a Jingle Bells Ensemble. This time we have a Dreidel Ensemble. And they are uh, lining up in the wrong place. Oh, nope, they're good. Okay, and um, so this is a group of students who either um, have previous experience on their instruments or have extra instruction outside of school, private instruction. The other cool thing that happened was a number of students said, Ms. McDonald, I only started this year, but I want to work really hard and I want to be part of that too. So unfortunately we can't fit everybody, as you can see it's already quite a tight squeeze. Um, we can't fit everybody up there, but it's so great to see the kids' ambition and wanting to work extra hard and do that. And there are going to be plenty more opportunities for people to do these extra advanced ensembles coming up. Uh, that's, that's all I have to say. In general, I have to say, I'm very lucky to teach your children. Every day I come to work, I laugh at something hilarious they do or something funny they say. Um, it's absolutely my pleasure to be their teacher, and thank you for letting me teach them. And uh, let's see, so we're going to perform Dreidel. And yes, you have to sing for this one too. And then we'll be performing one last tune. <laughs> 